All right, there's a new Steam hardware survey that was just taken today, and um, let's take a look at it. So 60.51% of all people that use Steam are on Windows 10. And then, um, wow, 33% of people are on Windows 11? For, I thought that everybody had like a global understanding and agreement together that Windows 11 wasn't ready yet. And it's like, there's like a massive list of incompatible games for Windows 11 somewhere on Reddit. Um, system RAM. Okay, so 51% of people have 16 gigabytes of RAM. That's what I had just up until recently, and then I just upgraded because um, 32 gigabytes of RAM was only like 50 bucks. It's like the lowest I've ever seen it. I've never seen RAM that cheap. It might still be cheap right now. Five percent of people are still on four gigabytes. Okay, so it's just sixteen gigabytes, eight gigabytes, and thirty-two gigabytes. That makes sense. This is a very accurate survey. So twenty percent of people, eighteen point nine percent of people are on eight gigabytes. Fifty percent of people are on sixteen gigabytes, and only sixteen percent of people are, are master racers. Only one percent of people have sixty-four gig. It's going up a little bit because RAM is, well, not really, 0 0.04. That's not really that significant. Wow, this is very, wow, this is very diverse, the video cards. Let's go to the top one. Okay, so the most popular one is the GTX 1650. That's a horrible video card. I feel bad for gamers. Why would they do themselves like that? Where's the GTX 1080? Wow, that's not even on there. What? Only 0.94% of people own this video card I'm using. Wow, more people have a better video card than me? Ah, oh, that's not gonna work. I need to buy a new video card. There's... Ugh. People have better video cards. Gamers have better video cards than me. Look, I'm only down here. 0.94% of people are still using a GTX 1080. But the GTX 1080 is such a beast. All my videos are from the GTX 1080. I cannot believe that. More people own a 3080 than a 1080? That's hard to believe. You would think there would be more 1080s. What the fuck? Ah, how much does a GTX 3080 cost? I'm like behind on the times. What the fuck? How does everybody own this card? It's a thousand dollar card. That can't be right. More people own a 3080 than a 1080? What? How old is the GTX 1080? I, I'm thinking in my brain it's two years older. <laughs> wow, it's been time flies when you're having drugs. Wow. Let's see what most people... Oh. 4K? What? Oh, wait, what? Hold on. What? Maybe that's just like a ver maybe a very few amount of people have a multi monitor. Let's go. To, let's ignore that one. Primary monitor. Okay, so let's nineteen twenty ten eighty. Sixty four percent of people are at that. That's what I'm at. That's what makes sense. Did you know that like fourteen forty p is literally two times more pixels than um ten eighty p? Well, not literally. It's but it's roughly two times more pixels. That's pretty heavy. Like double 1080p the thing that manufacturers have been struggling to get games to run at at 60 fps for the last decade double that 1440p is a huge hefty difference double literally double pixels of the what is considered high definition 
So, and then you start going into 4K, and it's just laughable. I don't, it's like, it's literally a joke. How many pixels? It's 8 million. 1920 times 1080 is 2 million. 1440p is 4 million. And 8K is 8 million. So, like, when people think, like, oh, I'm not going to upgrade. I'll just do, like, an incremental little upgrade. Like, I'll get a, I'm not going to go 4K. I'll go 1440p. Dude, that's a huge deal. Like, people don't understand that shit. Like, it's a multiplier. Like, they multiply. Like, you know what I mean? It's fucking massive. And this is this would be 1440p right here. Alright, so I'm proud of gamers that everyone's favoring 1920-1080. Because after a certain point, it just becomes really up to the quality of the monitor. And you can cram as many pixels in as you want. I've seen 4K monitors that look like ass. That look like washed out shit. Um, free hard drive space. I feel like this is almost like a travesty. Like, yeah, I actually deal with that too. Like, hard drive space has not gotten cheaper over the years. Like, it's gotten faster. But, like, even I have, like, hard drive space. Like, all my drives are, like, this SSD is only 450 gigabytes. This SSD is only 250. And then this is my new NVMe, which is one terabyte. I should have got the two terabyte one. And look, I, I only have, like, look at my library. I only have, like, 1% of all my games installed, you know? So it's like, bro, we need a new... What is this? People still play this? That guy, that guy absolutely ruined that game. He has no idea what made Morsey good. Um... I love gaming. I like looking at games on a list like this, like with the big icons. I should do this more often. Alright, um, VR headsets. I wish it showed the amount of people that have zero, that have no headset. Oh, look, right here. Steam users with VR headsets, 1.8%. Okay, so nobody has VR headsets. This is very informative. How do people have six physical CPUs? What CPU could that be? What? It doesn't say the model? That's strange. How come it doesn't have the Intel or AMD? That's almost like weird. That's almost like Illuminati creepy. Like why wouldn't they tell us what model? It's the only thing that's empty strange PC processor usage by manufacturer what the fuck does that even mean I don't know what that means I have no idea what that means Vulcan systems? It's like the API or something? Why does that matter? Alright. That'll do it. Is there anything else? What about like, um... Wow, so 25% of Steam users are using Chinese language on Steam. Could we play with Chinese Steam players? Because I never see like Chinese Steam community hub messages. Is it like separated or something? Let's look at the hard drive space. Total hard drive space. Okay, so the most amount of people have somewhere between 240 gig and 500 gig. Above one terabyte actually. No, I'm sorry. I take that back. Above one terabyte. A lot of people have above one terabyte, but that, if it's a mechanical spinning disk, then that's, 
I'm honestly impressed with gamers in general. Like, I, I thought more people would have shitty computers. And it seems like Steam users in general do have discrete graphic cards. So it's like, it's not... I, I, I don't know. I just always have had it in my mind that people are stupid. Alright, thanks for watching.